Frozen 2 is shaping up to be one of Disney's most highly anticipated movies of 2019. Teasers for the movie have been released as far back as June of this year, and we have been dying to gather as much information for this film as possible. So far, we've seen some seriously interesting plot elements that have been teased since the movie's initial announcement, one of which being that Elsa, the star of the series, now seems to have fire powers. Disney has debuted several scenes from the film, with many behind-the-scenes details being shared at the Annecy International Film Festival several months ago. Many have begun to declare that Frozen 2 is Disney's most highly anticipated sequel in history, and they may very well be correct. The original Frozen film was almost unimaginably successful, gathering over $1.26 billion at the box office during the initial airing in theaters. The first film was heavily based around two sisters, Anna and Elsa, and their journey to thwart evil and stick together. Throughout the film, their bond was pushed to its limits and truly tested the girls' relationship. Judging from the trailers for Frozen 2, this key plot element will be carrying over to the second film. In the trailer for Frozen 2, we can see that four large stones appear at the entrance of the Enchanted Lands. Many fans have stated that these four stones appear to have etchings on them that correspond to each of Earth's four main elements. This seems to be true judging by what we have seen so far. The Enchanted Lands are a place filled with magic and unforeseen twists and obstacles for our favorite characters. The trailer seems to show that each of Earth's elements will be demonstrated in some form or another within the Enchanted Lands, truly testing Anna and Elsa's abilities. The Enchanted Lands used to be a calm, quiet, and exciting place to visit. However, somewhere along the way this changed. The entrance to the Enchanted Lands was closed off forever, and all were forbidden to enter. However, Elsa sets out to change that. As our group of heroes approach the entrance to the Enchanted Lands, we see that the entire area is covered by a deep, thick fog that can seemingly not be broken. Though Elsa uses her powers to part this fog and gains entrance to the lands once more. Using information not only from the trailer but also from the first film, we can gather that Elsa has a connection with nature that isn't shared among other characters. She has a way of interacting with the world around her that seems entirely foreign, yet quite impressive. She is able to see, touch, and even hear things that other members of the cast cannot, and she oftentimes uses these abilities to her advantage and helps her friends and sister out along the way. Keeping this in mind, during the Frozen 2 trailer, we see that Elsa is somehow making contact with a woman whose voice she is able to hear clearly, yet no one else is aware of the woman's presence. We learn that this voice seems to belong to her mother, or someone who is impersonating her mother, and the voice seems to be targeting Elsa specifically. This small detail in the trailer further amplifies the fact that Elsa is able to connect with nature on a much deeper level than the other characters, but can this ability also translate to her magical powers as well, allowing her to manipulate more than just ice, but also fire? It's no secret that Elsa was born with an ability to control ice, though in the trailer for Frozen 2, we see the lieutenant ask Elsa, where did you learn magic? This is a key phrase that makes all the difference in the fan theories about the film. Prior to this line, it was not made known that magic could be learned. If this is the case, it begs the question, what other types of magic, aside from the ability to manipulate ice, can Elsa possibly learn? It seems as though Elsa's powers know no bounds, and she is only limited by her own desires or beliefs. However, one rather frightening topic that is mentioned in the trailer is that Elsa's powers can often be too much for her to handle. Her powers have the ability to spiral out of control and potentially cause harm to Elsa or those around her. In a flashback sequence, it appears as though this has been known since Elsa was a child, hence why Anna is now her caretaker. Anna must stick by Elsa through thick and thin to ensure that both Elsa and her loved ones remain safe and that Elsa doesn't get too cocky and risk her life. In the trailer, we can see that magical elements have begun to turn on those who inhabit the enchanted lands or the surrounding areas. We see tornadoes tearing through local downs, a giant beast made from rock and dirt, ice storms, and even an uncontrollable fire that is threatening to completely destroy the enchanted lands and all who are in it. These key moments further explain just how far magic can fall out of control if it is being used without proper precautions or supervision. We can see in the trailer a wild horse that is threatening Elsa. However, before the situation falls out of hand, Elsa actually learns to tame the horse. This is once again further evidence that each of the Earth's elements can be tamed by Elsa and gives a bit more explanation to the use of her firepowers that we have seen in several teasers. 
What's even more interesting is that each of the elements in the trailer appear to have conscious minds of their own. Each element is able to react with the world in a very human-like way, and in a manner that makes it very obvious that these elements know exactly what they are doing and are very deliberate in their actions. So, if Elsa is able to communicate with objects, people, and powers that others are aware of, Cold Elsa could also be able to communicate with Earth's elements and use them for good rather than evil? The trailer explains that Elsa isn't afraid of literally running through fire, even though Anna tries to talk her out of it. Could this be because Elsa has become more self-aware and knows that she now has the abilities that allow her to control the natural elements that surround her? If so, it stands to reason that not only could Elsa be able to control fire, but also ice, wind, and earth. While we may not fully understand how Elsa is able to control fire until the film is officially released, these are definitely some key moments from the trailers and teasers that can give us a slightly better understanding into how exactly Elsa is able to control fire in the scenes and screenshots that we have seen from the film thus far.